Alright, so this down here, this is a PS2 that I supposedly tried to repair because the lens was dead, so I figured I'd try and replace it. But now it seems like it might be a um, uh, hazard now. Yeah. So I have right here a uh, Dancing Stage Mega Mix for the PS2. It's a blue disc, so it's a CD. When I installed it, it was absolutely fine. I tried a PS1 game on it, I tried Soul Reaver, then I tried a PS2 DVD game on it, being Sonic Heroes. It was all brilliantly fine. But ever since I put in a PS2 CD game into it, it starts to become like a hazard, like an awful smelling one, which you'll see in a minute. There, 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 there. So in case you didn't hear that, it was squeaking while it was spinning the disc fast. So now, oh, oh God. Yeah, there we go. Smells again. Yeah. Well, look. If I turn on the torch, look at that. There is no sign of any smoke. Nothing. Oh, oh, fuck. oh God. And, uh, yeah, I don't know what happened at all. And, yeah, so... But the worst part about this is... Ever since I, if I put in a PS2 DVD into there, it actually just doesn't work now. What would happen is that before initially it, when it did this error, well not really an error, but an issue, but when it did do that weird smoking thing, it tried to read a PS2 disc like a DVD one when I tried it, but then it ended up basically just spinning and then like stopping and whatever. But ever since I let it try to run a bit more, just to see on the off chance it would go away, well, I thought I heard like a weird tiny pop noise or something. Turns out, when I tried a Sonic Heroes again, then it was just going tick, 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 tick. Like it was just stopping and starting, like emittently. And the worst part about this is that I had one laser that just did this when I was messing around with unplugging in, plugging back in when I was trying to do Mechapone stuff on it. Turns out the model was incompatible. And the second laser, um, yeah, well, that had issues because that was somewhat my fault trying to fix it with the potentiometers but the problem is is that it wasn't reading like sonic heroes correctly and i know that game works because it works on my old childhood ps2 which i have right down here so it's not the game or anything and it was intermittent when it was working either but now i've got this one and ever since i put a ps2 cd game in it um yeah it tried to kill itself and now it is a Hazard if you try to put in a PS2 CD game in it. So that's brilliant. Look on my second video and I will have something um, like a testing going on with the other one, with the other PS2. Okay, this is video two of the issue. And this time I've got my childhood PS2 with the same game. So I'll show you this is fine. The one that I was trying to fix was a 70,000 series model PS2. But my childhood PS2 is a 77,000 model. Because it's been modded with Mechapone, it does seem to do that with PAL PS2 games, so it's, it's fine. There it goes, spinning. Not only does the game actually load faster and actually work, but... You hear that? Yeah, I don't hear it. No buzzing at all. It's absolutely fine. So... I don't know. I, I don't get this. So I'm not sure if this PS2 over here, I don't know if it's like cursed or if every single lens I've gone through has just died in one way or another. And then my PS2 just decides to like kill the rest of them that I put in here. No idea at all. If there's any clue, that would be really appreciated. Because I have no idea. The first one was a genuine one that it came with, and then the second one was a aftermarket one, and then the third one was a different model, but it was genuine. Because the first two were an SPU3170, but only one was a generic one. And the third one was a KHM model, which I had to use PS2 Lens Changer for, to get it to work with it. And it was fine. 
But I put the PS2 CD game in, and then all hell just breaks loose. PS2 became a fire hazard. So I can only play PS1 games on it now, and audio CDs. I can't play PS2 CDs on it, and DVD discs are out the question. Uh, yeah, thanks for watching, and uh, goodbye.